Here's the season to be jolly. Tra la 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 la. Hey guys, welcome to my new video. Yes, as you're watching this video, please hit that like button, subscribe button, and turn on the bell notification. And don't turn this video off because I was singing that kind of thing to save life. But anyway, as I've got in, into the singing mode, guys, have a look at this Christmas tree. Now doesn't that Christmas tree look lovely? You got Santa climbing up, you got a train going round. Yes, shame to tell you, it is nothing but a big scam. Yes, this is from a website called if I remember correctly, amazly .com. Yes, this tree is advertised all over Facebook, Instagram, all over websites, and everything. You know, stupid me, I've seen it advertised. You know, I mean, I was like, ooh, that's a nice tree. I wasn't going to think about putting a Christmas tree up. And uh, I've seen it, I was like, oh, I'll order that, you know what I mean? Then I got a hinge or a hunch that uh, it was a scam, so I paid by PayPal. So, yeah, so long story short, I paid by PayPal and I got the money back. But I was one of the lucky ones, you know what I mean? So, I'm here to tell you guys that it is coming up to Christmas. We've got these scams going and I want to tell you about, about this website going and I want you to, to make people aware of it in case you see it on your Facebook or on any socials wherever you see it with a tree like this. Yes, not only is that, I like say the name called the amateurly.com, they have different company names as well and uh, which is a bit shocking. Yeah, so different company names as well and uh, when you pay by PayPal, it comes up with a different company name how you're paying all together. So this is just a quick video just to let you know guys. I mean, I've been on Trustpilot and a lot of people have uh, been scammed. You know what I mean? So I'm not the only one who's been scammed with this tree. People are receiving this tree and uh, they're getting a, like, a six inch tree or a one inch tree with some tacky decorations. You know what I mean? So I'm going to tell you guys that if you think that a website looks legit or the price, I mean the price I was going to pay was $27.99 for this tree and I was a six foot for all the decorations. I didn't click on that the, it could have been a scam. I mean, stupid me. Normally I don't fall for this sort of stuff, you know what I mean? But yeah, it is a proper scam. So yeah, so if you guys are going to look for anything for shopping wise and you have never used a site before you should check it out on Trustpilot now talk about Trustpilot Trustpilot has given this company well not the company, the reviews is 100% bad um, so not only is the company 100% bad this is a couple of reviews on the Trustpilot about this scam company. So yeah, I'm just making you guys aware of uh, the scam going around. Everyone has been hit by this scam, especially with coming up to Christmas. I mean, a lot of people fall for this stuff, even I fell for it, you know what I mean? But luckily the next day I got in touch with PayPal, I actually rang them and uh, they were quick on it. And I got my money back, back within two days. Why? Because when the PayPal advisor looked up this company, they seen that a lot of people have been scammed by this company name. But what I don't understand is if PayPal knows that this company has been scammed, why don't they make people away? that this company has scammed, scammed loads and loads of people, you know what I mean, I just don't get it, but uh, it is still out there, I even spoke to Facebook about it, because uh, they, they sent me a warning, you know, they warned me that uh, the comment I made on their, on their website, it was, uh, goes against their policy, and I was like, what, because I wrote on it, 
when I first when I first uh, seen it advertised, I, I was whoop whoop. I've, I've just bought this, and apparently that comment goes against their policy. How does that even work? You know, I mean, so I got my first warning on Facebook, and uh, my friend did the same. He got a warning, tell him because he told Facebook it was a scam, and Facebook came back and that goes against the uh, our company policy, saying the company were a scam. But it's true, you know. I mean, yeah. So I'm just a quick video, guys, to make you aware of this company and watch out for it. There's a few different company names, but you just want, want to make sure the sites you're gonna be thinking about ordering from. And you've not ordered one before, check the reviews out on Trustpilot because it will help you so much. This is something I didn't do, and this is what I'm going to do in the future to save yourself from being scammed. But it's absolutely shocking that you get people are getting scammed at Christmas, you know. I mean, I mean, you know, it's, it's shocking. But luckily, I got my money back. There was many others who have lost like hundreds of pounds on this uh, site. You know, ordering different products. Yeah, it's absolutely crazy. So, what do you think about this this company scam people? Have you actually been scammed before? And what do you do to get your money back? If you got a comment on this, please put a comment in the box below. And uh, yeah, just watch out what you're buying, guys, on the internet. I thought it was too good to be true now that I've. Uh, Got this good treat. I didn't think about uh, how cheap it was. You know what I mean? Just something I didn't do. You know, I thought, oh god, Steven's being scammed again. <laughs> but yeah, never mind. But quick video, guys. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe button, turn on the bell notification, and then uh, until the next video, guys. I'll see you soon.